guys, I'm out here at the Steel Scramble and it's super confusing. So I hope to be able to tell you how it works soon. But essentially you change positions and shoot your guns. We'll see how good everybody does with it. Station three is where, at the Steel Scramble, is where you're gonna go out and shoot at 100 yards of a moving target. You can see him going back and forth out there still. So you uh, aren't limited on positions just as long as you're resting on this barrier here and you get uh, 90 seconds to take 10 shots. Moving on to the next station for a steel scramble. This one, you have to shoot from four different positions. Most people don't use the fifth position down there. You can do them in any order. You get three shots per position and you have to hit these five targets, which actually have kind of small uh, hit plates. Let's see if I can show them. Can't see. They're right out there. And so those five gongs right there, you shoot one, two, three, and then in a new position, shoot number three, four, and five. And then in the next position, you actually shoot number five, then four, then three. And in the last position, you shoot number three again, number two, and number one. And then you move on over to here, and we have the first station where you actually shoot off the rocks and you shoot the same gong over and over. I'll show it to you now. And the fifth, um, section of the steel scramble is where you shoot here from these rocks and you have to choose five different positions and you take two shots per position and you can use the same position again after the third time so you can shoot one time here twice two shots two shots two shots and then at that point you can go back and take another two shots from one of your pre previous positions or you could take up other positions here you're shooting from the rocks 80 yards out to a gong it's sitting right out there that looks like a ram. And so all these different positions of shooting and different distances and things like that just make it for um, a fun and challenging event. And lots of people have lots of fun with it. I know I had a great time with it and um, definitely recommend that if you make it out here, be sure that you sign up for the Steel Scramble. But it is one of the first events. So make sure that you are here on the first days of the event so that you can catch it. Because if you come later in the event, you'll miss it. So definitely check it out. And tomorrow I'm going to show you all more. Alright, so this is the fourth stage at the Steel Scramble EBR 2023. On this stage, your full body has to be on this platform. Nothing can be touched in the concrete at all. There is a, a spinner at 50 yards. There's a, a bottom one and then a top one if you dare to shoot that one. Uh, you get 10 shots. If you can hit it enough, it will spin all the way around. If you do so, you'll get 10 extra bonus points. So, um, 110 points possible on this lane. Really fun event. Okay. Shooter, understand the course of fire. Oh, yes, I do. Shooter, ready? Yes, I am. Oh, yeah. Shooter, ready. Engage. I'm at the fifth station at the Steel Scramble. Two shots at 25, two at 50, 75, 125, 150, and 200. 12 shots total. Back. 
One minute, 20 seconds. Back. 150 yards. Back. 30 seconds. Back. 200 yards. Back. Nice. Nicely yeah. done. Wow. <laughs> Very good job. <laughs> Sweet. Nice. Thank you. Can you tell my camera who you are and what you just shot? I'm Francisco Aitajaga and I shot a Cuban K1 from my friend Linas. Yes, say we yes, saw Linas same earlier. Same. Yeah, y'all did awesome. My first time is trying this. Uh, it was fun, right? Very fun. Very fun. fun. It's especially fun whenever you're awesome at it like you. Okay, right? <laughs> All right, thanks.
it. Yep. Hit! Hit! On the seven and eight. Thirty. I just knew I was almost out of bounds. Jessica with Iguana Solutions. I'm out here at the Extreme Ventrest in Arizona. It's 2023. Um, this is my fourth year coming here. Every year brings new um, adventures, new friends, and new knowledge. So um, I've benefited every time I've come and I definitely am benefiting this time around. Um, I gotta send a shout out to Claudio, uh, Claudio over at Patagonia Air Guns. He spent um, extra effort yesterday on helping me lighten my trigger pull. And um, I've just had so many people show me information about making their own pellets, um, what pellets work best for them, people that are also shooting the ghost like me and what they've gotten from their ghost. And so um, the, the amount of knowledge and the amount of information that you get from people and it's quality information, it's just mind blowing. I, I feel like when I come here, it's the greatest improvement I get every year is whenever I leave here. So um, today I'm gonna be shooting the Extreme Bentrust, the, well not today, but through the event. Extreme Bentrust, Extreme uh, Field Target. We're gonna do the Steel Scramble, which is a fun uh, thing where you go to different stations and shoot different steel targets at different uh, lengths. And so um, I, I hope to share different parts of the event with y'all. Some of it will be film, filming me, but some of it will be footage of other people doing the event so that I can show y'all everything that's going on, and all the fun guns, and all the different equipment that's here. So join us, and I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. You do your thing. They're two yards. They make it all the way through the day as mine is concerned. Right. 
So if y'all didn't know, all these grown men walk around with their air guns that they treat as babies actually in baby strollers. They push around baby strollers with their air guns and their air tanks and I think it's hilarious. Air gun baby, air gun baby stroller. Okay, line is clear. So guys, that's the end of day one and it shows the steel scramble and the extreme field target. Today is going to be 50 yard uh, bench rest and some other stuff like that. So I'm going to make another video that shows you everything that happens today on Friday, the second day of extreme bench rest in 2023. Thanks for joining.